Welcome to pre-math. In this video, we are going to simplify this uh, radical expression square root of 17 minus uh, the square root 77 minus uh, the square root of 78 minus 2 times uh, square root of 77. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. Let's go ahead and get started. And since we are dealing with a bunch of these radicals, so we are going to simplify it by going from inside out. So therefore, let's focus on this radicand first. And here I have copied it down and let's go ahead and manipulate this expression. We can write this 78 as 77 plus 1, as you can see in this next step. And now let's go ahead and tweak this 77. 77 could be written as square root of 77 whole square. So therefore this whole expression could be written as square root of 77 whole square plus this one could be written as 1 square minus 2 times square root of 77 times 1. And now let's recall this famous identity a minus b whole square could be written as a square plus b square minus 2 times a b. We are going to apply over here. So this whole thing is going to become square root of 77 minus 1 whole square. So therefore we can see that this uh, radicant has been simplified to this one. As you can see in this next step, this whole thing, this radicant has been replaced by this. And now we can see that this square and square root, they undo each other. So we simply ended up with the square root of 17 minus square root of 77 minus inside this parentheses we got square root of 77 minus 1. Now let's go ahead and distribute this negative sign. So we are going to get 17 minus square root of 77. So this is going to give us negative square root of 77 and this is going to become plus 1. Now let's go ahead and combine the like terms. 17 plus 1 is going to give us 18 and when we combine these two like terms that's going to give us minus 2 times square root of 77 as you can see in this next step. And now let's focus on this radicant 18 minus 2 times square root of 77. And here I have copied it down and let's go ahead and manipulate this expression. Here 18 we can write this one as 11 plus 7 isn't it? And likewise we can write this uh, square root of 77 as square root of 11 times square root of 7. As you can see in this next step, let's go ahead and tweak this uh, 11. 11 could be written as square root of 11 and then a whole square. Likewise, this 7 could be written as square root 7 and then a whole square. Whole thing is going to become square root of 11 whole square plus uh, square root of 7 whole square minus 2 times square root of 11 times square root of 7. And now let's recall this identity once again a minus b whole square we are going to apply over here. So this whole thing uh, could be written as uh, square root of 11 minus uh, square root of 7 whole square. So therefore this whole radicand has been simplified to this form. So therefore we can write this one as square root of 11 minus square root of 7 whole square. And now we can see that this square and square root they undo each other. So we simply ended up with the square root of 11 minus square root of 7 and that's our answer.
So thus our simplified answer turns out to be a square root of 11 minus square root of 7. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.